Hello friends, uh, this is Perways and today is our 10th video in Python 3 and OpenCV. Uh, in the last video we have uh, discussed about face detection, about uh, how uh, OpenCV uh, trained classifiers. Uh, we have uh, talked about Harkis kit classifier and also we had uh, an example. We have uh, uh, successfully detected faces in the image. Uh, this is the sam uh, sample example. Uh, if I run this, you can see we have uh, successfully detected the faces, seven faces. Okay. Uh, if you haven't watched the previous video, I recommend you that you should watch the previous video because we are using the codes from the previous video and there will be no change in the code. Just we want to change the classifier, not all the codes. So uh, please. Uh, check the nine, check the nine video and watch that. After that, come back in in the tenth video. Okay. In today's video, we will uh, discuss about LBP uh, face detection. Uh, we will make an example for this. Uh, we have discussed a lot in the ninth video, but in this video, we will make an example. Uh, now. Uh, if I run this, uh, this was hard cascade classifier, uh, and also we can see that we have seven faces. Uh, LBP classifier uh, is also trained uh, and has uh, an XML files. Uh, uh, I have uh, uh, downloaded uh, the this from the GitHub. I will add this the link of LBP cascade frontal face. Uh, you can take this from the GitHub. Now, uh, I want to change this to LBP, uh, Cascade Classifier. Uh, first, I will uh, make an example. After that, I will uh, show the difference between these two uh, classifiers. Uh, now, I rename and I take copy the name, paste it in here. LBP cascade underscore frontal face dot XML. Okay. Now, if I run this, you can see that uh, the LBP cascade classifier detected eight faces, uh, seven in here and one in here. Uh, obviously, this is not a face, but uh, mm, it is de detected as a face. Okay. Now, uh, I want to add test another image. Uh, first, I test in LBP. Okay, uh, my image name is uh, Ronaldo. JPG. Okay. Now, if I run this, you can see that uh, faces found four, one, two, three, four. But uh, in this image, if you uh, carefully watch, we have uh, six faces: one, two. Three, four, five, and six. Now, if I change my uh, classifier to hard case kit, uh, let me rename, copy this, and paste it in here. Now, if I run this, you can see that faces found six, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six faces. Now, What's the difference between those, these two uh, classifiers? The first one, LBP classifier, and the second one, Harkis kit classifier. I have an image in here. These are the advantages and disadvantages of these two classifiers. The first one, Harkis kit. Advantage. It is high detection accuracy. I have proved this for you that uh, in here, uh, if I run this, this is accurate. Because we have six faces in here and six faces found, uh, uh, it's also low false positive rate. Uh, uh, but what's the disadvantage? Uh, it is uh, complex and slow. Uh, also, uh, it, is, it, it needs longer training time. Uh, also, it is less accurate on black faces, not all terms, but on black faces. And also, it has some limitations in. Uh, Difficult lighting conditions, but 
about what about LBP? Uh, LBP is so simple and also it's fast. Uh, it needs shorter training time. Uh, uh, but what's the disadvantage? Uh, it's less accurate. Uh, you have watched that uh, in in the first uh, in the first image uh, it was seven, but it detected eight images. And the, in the second image it was uh, six images, six faces. Uh, sorry, but it detected uh, four faces. So it is less accurate, and it has high false positive rate. Now. Uh, as we have uh, mentioned that uh, each OpenCV face detection classifier has its own uh, advantages and uh, disadvantages. But uh, the major difference uh, are in accuracy and speed. Uh, I can tell that LBP is so fast, but hard casket is so slow. Uh, hard casket is accurate but LBP is not accurate not more accurate uh, so uh, in case of more accurate detection are required then we should use uh, hard, hard casket classifier uh, because this is more suitable and this is more accurate and also this is suitable for uh, uh, mm, technologies uh, such as security systems and other things but uh, LBP classifier is faster but not accurate. Therefore, it should be used in uh, some mobile applications, maybe or embedded systems. Uh, okay. Uh, now, this was uh, the difference between hard casket and LBP classifiers. Uh, if you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, please subscribe my channel.